Well, people with Down syndrome are at high risk of developing Alzheimer's-like dementia at a very young age. But local researchers are testing an experimental vaccine that might not only prevent Alzheimer's in people with Down syndrome, but in the general population as well. Dr. Malika Marshall explains. 29-year-old Michael Clayberg has Down syndrome, but that doesn't hold him back. Michael has three jobs. He works at Target, McDonald's, and Dunkin' Donuts. He's also quite the Special Olympics athlete. But perhaps Michael's greatest contribution will be a scientific one. He could be a major factor in finding the cure to Alzheimer's disease. People with Down syndrome have an extra copy of chromosome 21. One of the genes on that chromosome can also lead to plaque buildup in the brain. That goop in the brain, when it starts to come together, can really disrupt neuronal function and lead to the dementia that's associated with Alzheimer's. In fact, up to 50% of people with Down syndrome will develop dementia by age 50. Dr. Brian Scottco is the director of the Down syndrome program at Mass General Hospital. His 38-year-old sister, Kristen, also has Down syndrome. Because of her, I wanted to become his doctor, and one day I wanted to be able to do research for and with people with Down syndrome. Dr. Scottco is studying a vaccine designed to harness the body's own immune system to gobble up plaques and prevent the onset of dementia. Mass General and two other centers are recruiting up to 24 patients in a phase one clinical trial testing its safety. Michael is one of those patients. Michael, Hi. how are you? He gets an injection every one to two months, followed by blood tests and MRIs. How do you feel about being part of this study? How, do, how does it make you feel? Happy. The study is being funded in part by a nonprofit organization called Lumind RDS Foundation. CEO Hampus Hillestrom's four-year-old son, Sebastian, has Down syndrome. If my son could start taking it early on and delay the onset of Alzheimer's by uh, decades, it would be wonderful. On a personal level, there is nothing I want more for my patients and my sister is to one day potentially have a vaccine, have a cure to prevent Alzheimer's from happening. They work too hard, they have too much potential, they're too wonderful people to have it all go away due to Alzheimer's. And if Michael does develop Alzheimer's? Hopefully it will be 10 to 15 years from now and this vaccine will be available to him and he'll be all set. <laughs> Let's hope. <sighs> if all goes well with the clinical trials, Dr. Scott Coe says this vaccine could become available in the next 10 years or so, not only to try to prevent Alzheimer's disease in patients with Down syndrome, but in the general population as well. I'm Dr. Malika Marshall, WBZ News. Mm -hmm. Phenomenal. Well, we have much more still ahead.